Each May of every year, the new members of the Swiss Guard swear to loyally protect the Pope. These are the men that are tasked with the security of Benedict XVI at the Vatican. We as free men provide volunteer service to the Holy Church. Il Signore. The Lord asks each one of you if you swear to serve faithfully, loyally and honorably the Supreme Pontiff Benedict XVI. The new guards salute the flag with a curious gesture. They raise three fingers to symbolize a trinity. Benedict XVI traveled to the Italian region of Tuscany to visit Arezzo. Despite the wind and rain, thousands of people from across the country joined him. The Pope asked them to remain faithful to their Christian tradition. A book's publication deepened the Vatty leak scandal, highlighting the massive leak of papal documents. They did not contain controversial content, but rather confidential reports that questioned the trust behind the Pope's entourage. Several days later, the investigation started bearing results as the Pope's butler, Paolo Gabriele, was arrested. The trial against the butler started at the end of September. Benedict XVI was unable to hide his suffering by what was going on. Gli avvenimenti successi in questi giorni circa la curia e i miei collaboratori hanno recato tristezza nel mio cuore, ma non si è mai offuscata la ferma certezza che nonostante la debolezza dell'uomo, le difficoltà e le prove, la Chiesa è guidata dallo Spirito Santo. The Pope welcomed the President of Bulgaria during a general audience whose highlight was a one-of-a-kind gift. During the Holy Week, many were surprised to see a large chocolate Easter egg. This time around, the gift was a jewelry piece measuring more than six feet tall. Italian President Giorgio Napolitano gave Benedict a concert as a gift to celebrate the seventh year of his pontificate. For the first time, director Riccardo Muti conducted an orchestra before the Pope. 